while the vanishing family and was shot in New Jersey by Ruth Streeter, who is one of the most beautiful women I have ever seen, and there she was in New Jersey in the slums of it, you know. But the vanishing family was just that. It was the inversion of things. That is to say, um, in slavery days, the men were working in the fields and the women were working in the house. It was an inversion. And and that continued. The women the women in the black society were in charge. And they just they made the, the decisions. So the vanishing family was really the turning family, you know. And it was shot in New Jersey in the slums. And these, the police, we hired the police as a bodyguard for Ruth Streeter. <laughs> Do you think that the peace had any sort of impact on the, the situation in the welfare system? Uh, yes, it did, because it was in the Clinton administration. And the bill to change welfare was called the Vanishing Family. And uh, Clinton saw it. Uh, so it did have some change. And you'll see that the conditions for welfare changed during the Clinton administration. They had started the change with uh, Lyndon Johnson. And so it did have a, a great, a great effect. Mm. How did and that make you feel to know that? Well, I was glad to be part of it, of course, but I was uh, sort of a shepherd, and I, I don't think I wrote anything in it. You see, they'd bring the script to me, and I would make minor changes, editorial changes. Uh, a good producer is not, necessar not necessarily a good writer, and I have a background in writing. And, and then there's always the question of, do you need a line to be written, or does it say it on screen? Mm -hmm. You know, that's a, a big choice. <laughs>